we're about to make some asparagus stuff motherfucking chicken breast now i know y'all been seeing this damn recipe float around so i'm like man my gut needs it so i got to have it went to the store picked up the stuff you don't even need that many ingredients man it's a few things it really is i added some bacon into it because i like bacon and bacon make everything taste better <laughs> Get the chicken, wash it, trim it. You don't have to trim it. I like to trim it. I don't like looking at that that stringy white. I don't even know what it is. What is it? It's disgusting. Ugh. I like to just take that off. I don't know about y'all, but I yeah, I trim it nice like that. Look at that. Now that looks clean. Yeah. Make sure you pat it dry. Cut these things in half. Don't don't do like a full cut. Just like cut it like halfway, and then open the lips and just cut a little bit more until you're satisfied. But you don't want to cut it all the way. You need to have like some room. So when you like stuff it and close it, you don't want it to, the back to pop out. So I put some salt. What was that? Paprika. I don't even know what I'm putting on here. <coughs> What the hell are the seasonings? I think this is <laughs> like salt, pepper, paprika, onion powder, garlic powder, and I put um, some Louisiana seasoning on there. I just, I, I love that Louisiana seasoning, man, that Cajun seasoning. I like that. But the ingredients, you already seen the ingredients in that dude's pose. I'm saying you can freak the ingredients any way you want, but that's just, that's how I did it. Asparagus. I put some olive oil over the salt on it. I got some heirloom tomatoes because I couldn't find any um, sun-dried tomatoes. But uh, if you haven't tried heirloom tomatoes, man, you need to like just grow the fuck up and just stop stop eating regular regular tomatoes. Three asparagus in the middle. You see how I'm doing? How I'm stacking these things? Boom! Cheese. Oh my gosh! Look at the bacon, bro. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I, I just couldn't record myself stuffing because it was it was absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> it was extremely hard. But don't stuff it too much. I stuffed it way too much, but it came out perfect though. I use uh, toothpicks to uh to keep it closed. You can take the toothpicks. Well, obviously take the toothpicks out. But you don't want to cook it all the way through on the uh, on the pan on the cast iron. You just want to get the, the the nice sear on it on both edges. Look at that on both sides. I mean. Okay, you see it coming along? Cook it on medium. Look at that. I was afraid the asparagus was gonna cook thoroughly, but it did. Oh my God, guys, I made mashed potatoes for the first time. I had no fucking idea what I was doing. <laughs> that wasn't my hand that clap, by the way. So you're gonna get the potatoes, you're gonna peel them, you're gonna cut them in cubes, boil them, right? Drain it. We're gonna do sour cream, butter, milk. What else did I do? Uh, salt, pepper, and I think I did a little bit of uh, yeah, some garlic powder, right? And I just started mixing it, some pepper, and I think, and I, and I just mashed it. And I said, okay, this is this is starting to look pretty good. It's starting to smell pretty damn good. Taste a little bit. Okay, I need a little bit of more salt, a little bit more sour cream. I think I put a little bit more milk in there too. Oh my god, I just kept mixing and just too it was right. Like oh. I tell you this is the best mashed potatoes I've ever had in my damn life. Like how how do I do how does my gut know? So you know I got to like be fancy and throw some chives in that thing. Look at it. <laughs> who, who do I think I am? Look at this man. Look at this. <laughs> oh, I don't know how this guy even thought of this recipe. It's a simple recipe, but when I tell you this thing hits, look at it. Why does it have to hit like this? Asparagus cook. I thought the asparagus was gonna be too hard in the middle. It's not, man. And the and the juice from the bacon like seeping through it. Oh, bro, that's a certified, bona fide, verified, busted gut.